All right, since I have not seen this documented on the internet, or at least I've seen people say that you can't mod these radios, um, I just sat down with the thing for about half an hour, and well, I modded it. So this is the surface mount unit in PC68 LTX, is that what this is? LTX, yeah. So, um, all right, basically what I found with this thing the AMC doesn't work the same way it did in the old Cobra 25s and regular 68s. Uh, rather than dick around with that, I just kind of left it alone. I put a jumper on, um, I removed the diode that connects the, the secondary of the mod transformer to the collectors of the finals and jumpered it. Um, just what I did, I, I did the, uh, truck stop cap and resistor mod. Um, it doesn't work the same way as a 25 or a normal 68. There's no convenient jumper there that you can just put your cap and resistor on. So what you have to do is lift uh, the leg of this L206 here, the side, you know, that's not connected to the final. And um, that's where you're going to put your, your uh, swing mod in series with that. So uh, after doing that, we have it connected to the bird kilowatt dummy load uh, Tech 465 oscilloscope, and then I'm using a, an SDR as a, you know, amateur spectrum analyzer. So here we go. We'll start with the watt meter, about a 5 watt carrier. Hello, audio. Hello, hello, hello. Hello audio, hello, hello, hello. So we're seeing about 40 peak. Hello audio, one, two, three, four, five. Modulation well in excess of 200%. And we're not seeing any crazy splatter or anything like that. It's, uh, it's pretty damn clean. Well, I mean, considering we're pinching off the carrier like a son of a bitch. But anyway, it can be done. That's what I did to achieve those results. Those are the mods I did. That's it. Um, okay.